All right, they're going into the four wide. Salute to the fans formation. They should be there by the time we get to the back straightaway. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we need everybody up on your feet. Let's stand up and salute these drivers. They'll be saluting you back. Wave your hats, your handkerchiefs, your bag chairs, your mother-in-law. Let them see you. Let them hear you. Here they are, ladies and gentlemen, the cars and stars of the Durance Lane Chevrolet Dirt Late Model Series. Wave at them. They're waving at you. One of the most beautiful sights in all of motorsports, the four wide salute to the fans formation. He's going to the pit area. Your pole sitter, Kyle Courtney, has gone to the pits. The outside row will move up. It's time to go racing, ladies and gentlemen. Jamie Bolin in charge of the field from the outside of the front row as they approach the VP Racing Lubricant starting box. They're in it, they're on it. Green flag is out. Roland slides up in front of Bolin. Bolin will go through the middle. He'll thread the needle. He'll go between Roland and Greg Martin. Here comes Roland back on the inside, but it'll be Bolin leading the way. He'll lead lap number one. Running three wide, back through about seventh or eighth. Got one off the pace, caution flag coming out. Okay, they wave it off. They'll wave off the restart. Bolin can pick up the pace anywhere he wants to past the scoreboard. He's in the throttle, green flags out, we're racing. Greg Martin looking down on the bottom from the third spot in car number 24. He'll battle side by side with Will Rowland as they battle for second. And we got trouble on the front straightaway. The field got tangled up big time coming off of four. Will Rowland. Jamie Bolin brings him off the fourth turn. Green flags out. Three wide for second off at of turn two. Andy Picklesheimer. I don't call him squirt for nothing. He came right through the middle to squirt on up into that second spot. Oh, they spray in the bottom of three and four. Somebody got down in the water. They'll race through it, work it in. And then they put some more out there. But Jamie Boland staying high and dry in the 232. He's out in front of Andy Picklesheimer. Greg Martin in the third spot.
Jamie Bolin out to about a five car length advantage over Andy Picklesheimer. Greg Martin in third. Ashton Winger in fourth. A little bit of real estate between Winger and the fifth place car of Ross White. Corey Hedgecock, car number 23, running in sixth. Ethan Hunter in seven, Donald Johns in eighth. Jake Knowles running ninth in car number 66. As a side by side battle for third. Ashton Winger up on the outside battling with Greg Martin. And Winger will take the spot. Bolin can now see the cars on the tail end of the lead lap in front of him as he comes off a of turn four. Andy Picklesheimer beginning to close in in the P1 car. Picklesheimer now within a half car length of Jamie Bolin in the 232. Picklesheimer beginning to look to the inside of the race leader. Battle up front for the lead. Here they come. Jamie Bowen gets a little bit of breathing room as they begin to work lap traffic. Come your leaders off turn four. Jamie Bolin still out in front of Andy Picklesheimer. Bolin now going to the bottom of the racetrack in one and two. Doing a little groove searching. He'll stay to the top. Now goes to the bottom in three and four. Bolin looking for a faster way around the racetrack. He'll go to the inside, checking it out to try to move around lap traffic. Kosheimer now trying to regroup. Bowen back to the top. Cross flag signal of air. We're halfway, 25 down, 25 to go. Down the back straightaway. Caution flag coming out. 
One into the wall hard on the back straightaway. Matt Stewart in the 73 car brings out the caution flag. Works with his dad, Iron Mike Bolin, at Bolin Performance in Cuba, Alabama, where they build the track star race cars. Jamie Bolin gonna bring them back to green. Here they come, he's in the gas. Green flags out. Winger throws the slider. Bolin sideways off at two. He's down on the inside, gathers it up. He'll drop back to third. Bolin got a terrible restart. flag is out bad wreck on the back straight away what Ashton winger leading the field into turn three took over the lead on the last restart green flag is out everybody doing a little shake and bake in turn number one Greg Martin trying to slide up in front of Picklesheimer for second. Here comes Hedgecock on the inside. Hedgecock and Picklesheimer will go wheel to wheel for third. Here comes Hedgecock on the outside. He'll take third. So Ashton Winger out in front, Greg Martin running second. Corey Hedgecock in third. Eccleshimer in fourth. Fifth is Jamie Bolin. He'll get a challenge from Jake Knowles on the inside. Jake Knowles trying to work his way up into the top five. Trouble in turn four. Here they come, green flags out. Hedgecock looking to the inside of Greg Martin as they battle for second down the back straightaway. Martin able to hold off Hitchcock down the front straightaway. While they battle for second, Winger out in front by three car lengths. Side by side for fourth, Bolin trying to get underneath Picklesheimer. Greg Martin. In second, Hedgecock right with him. He's been looking inside and outside. Martin running right in the middle of the racetrack, making that 24 car as wide as he can get it. In the meantime, Ashton Winger pulling away. Car number 12. He has found a groove he likes. He is dialed in. He's got almost a half straightaway lead now over Greg Martin. Coming to lap number 40, 10 laps to go. 
40 complete, 10 to go. So Ashton Winger continuing to pull away from Greg Martin. Five laps to go. In front of the leader now, lap traffic. Winger will have to work the last five laps of the race in lap traffic. Can Greg Martin and Corey Hedgecock reel him in? Now to be four to go. And the 14 car almost spun in front of the leader. Winger to the outside, three to go. He'll get by the 14 of Jerry Green. Down the back straight away. Laps winding down. Here comes Ashton Winger with two laps to go. Martin has closed half the distance on Winger. Here they come. He almost gets into the one down the back straight away. Winger to the inside. He'll push the one up the banking in four. White flag is out. Now it's Martin and Hitchcock in heavy lap traffic on the final lap. Winger out in front. Clear racetrack in front of him. He'll negotiate turn three off of four. Down to the checkered flag. Win number two for Ashton Winger. It'll be Greg Martin in second. Corey Hitchcock in third. Fourth will go to Andy Picklesheimer. Jake Knowles in fifth. Jamie Boland sixth. Seventh is Marcus Minga. Jimmy Elliott will finish in eighth. Ninth is Jacob Anderson. And Will Rowland will round out the top ten.